I, I would like to say uh, something to John. John, uh, I just can't find the words to tell you how appreciative that I am. I, I've always felt that uh, that God would bless me in things that I would try to achieve and try to accomplish. But you have really restored uh, the faith in my life that God will always take care of me through good people. And I want to tell you that I really appreciate what you're doing for me. Well, uh, I really appreciate that. <clears throat> um, I, uh, you know, I'm a little speechless <laughs> and I cannot wait um, for this all to happen. You know, um, I think, like you said, uh, it's really uh, God working on in my life. My, <laughs> you know, I blush a little bit hearing you talk a little earlier because as my wife can probably tell you, I'm far from perfect. <laughs> and, um, you know, but, but uh, because of the Lord, I can, I get some things right. And uh, there's no doubt in my mind that this is one of those things that um, I've gotten right. And uh, I'm just, I am, I'm, I'm honored. I truly am to do this. Like I said, I've, I've been on the other side, you know, I've been one of your boys that's been waiting for their dad to get a kidney that sees them so tired and beaten up after dialysis and, and can't live life like they want to. And so October 14th can't, can't come fast enough for me either. I'm, I'm, I'm excited for the story to, to continue to be written. So thank you. I love you guys. I can't wait to hug you. I don't care about coronavirus. I'm going to do it anyways. And uh, Same here, October 12th. <laughs> Same here, Joe. We can't wait. So excited. I can't wait to meet right. you in person. Ooh. Thank you. Well, now I got to get me through the afternoon. <laughs> <laughs> We're so excited. <laughs>